right, y'all not wasting any time, huh? And Norris was good enough to let us stage in the council's suite of the inauguration. No doubt after you'll find showing in the general. No doubt. 81 percent? 82. In a city where Democrats outnumber Republicans nine to one. Anything less would have been an embarrassment. So, what can we do for you, Senator? Well, uh, first of all, I wanted to clear the air. Uh, if there are any hard feelings over what happened during the primary... You're gonna uh, give the money back? <laughs> <laughs> Senator, it's been a very long day. I'll cut to the chase. I understand you have a problem at the top of the police department. You asked Burrell to resign. He declined. I'm looking for a replacement. The ministers like Burrell. So does the council president. We're confident that when we identify a suitable candidate, Miss Campbell and the ministers will see the wisdom of new leadership. Except y'all need to get a pay raise through the city council. Pay raise would help. I can ask Norris about that pay raise getting passed. Maybe convince some of the ministers they need to move on from Burrell. The situation would have to be resolved sooner rather than later. Do my best, partner. And what do we do for you in return? I'm in Annapolis. Word I'm hearing, you may be there too in a couple of years. We may find ourselves working together closely. Thanks for your time. Jesus Christ. Be slick. Apologizes for the short con and in the next breath setting us up for the law. He and Burrell are thick as thieves. And do we know what the long con is? At least we know he's running one. She. 